Hi, and welcome to the Project Zalboid 30 Day Apocalypse Guide. So this is uh, day 22, I believe. So we've uh, went over here to the uh, weapon store. So actually, we're just going to show it on the map, right? So we know that there's uh, could be weapons there, there could be weapons there. We searched the entire place. We didn't find a single uh, crowbar, but we did find some axes, maybe some hat axes, and maybe we'll start leveling up our uh, axe skill. Um, so, I think we are looking for like a crowbar, we are hoping to find one up there, that was it, we didn't find it. There was an alarm system up there too, that's right. We uh, cleared the zombies, we managed to get actually into there, and then uh, the alarm system went off. Then we searched most of the boxes, and we still didn't find a crowbar there anyways. So what we're gonna do is maybe try to go down to these houses here, but uh, first... We're going to have to maybe organize our freezers a little bit. Sort of thinking about that. Because our freezers, they're pretty much uh, full at the moment. And we should go through and take out all the things that we don't need in there. Like all the things that don't save fresh. Uh, so we don't need to smoke yet. So let's go through here. I guess open this up. Ah, oh, that was just start uh, looting things that don't save fresh, right? So... Hot sauce, we can take that out. We can take the uh, juice box out and the lard. We can take the maple syrup out. Uh, the pickles. And then we can uh, replace them with things that we actually uh, want to put in here. So the uh, butter, we can take that out. And then for the uh, first little bit, we're just going to be uh, doing this here. Take out the uh, beer cans, the uh, beer bottles, beef jerky. Just give us some more inventory space to uh, put some more things in here that we're gonna go loot. I think we got up most of them. So three, we got most of the things for the freezer. Maybe we'll just uh, throw them in this uh, fridge for now. She got like another like, uh, oh, what's how much inventory space we cleaned up? Looked like we almost got like uh, 20 inventory space. So maybe like 18 inventory space in the freezers again. Just a lot of stuff we put in that we pulled from the fridges that we don't actually uh, need to freeze. Oh, the limes in here. Throw the lime in a freezer. And there we go. So we got all these ingredients here that we don't need to uh, freeze. We put in there. And then we got. There might have been some things that we missed, but we'll just leave them in there for right now. And then we come back and uh, organize it a bit more later. So we thought to uh, actually do that before we headed out. I was grabbing ice cream here. What's our uh, weight like, right? Weight's uh, 74 going down. Now we're gonna need some food here. Maybe we'll just bring out uh, two ice creams with that. Oh, so we got ice cream, we got uh, axes, we got weapons, we got a baseball bat if we need it. Light stick, water bottle, water bottle's full. This is gonna be going like uh, all the way to the south, pretty much. It's 
we search most of those houses, I think. So I think where we're trying to go is just to the uh, trailer park and the, the houses that were over by the uh, food market. I don't think we were able to get to those three houses down there yet. I think we actually got to those houses right there. Where is this place, I wonder? Oh, it's just over behind the place. I get it. So these places we didn't actually check. These places down here. So we uh, arrived where we were hoping to get to. If we're going to go through here, go to these houses. If there's a too many zombies guarding the places. Is it that place is burnt out. Oh, then maybe we can go collect some more food from down here. Yeah, it must be just right here. Oh, so it doesn't look like there's any zombies here at the moment. There's one zombie over. Oh, there's more than one zombie over here. She so got these ones. Looks like you got four or five of them. There's no way to hide us, I don't think. Oh no, there's no us now. It's not going to come behind us. So I think we'll just lead to the house, right? We uh, leave to the house, then circle around, then I'll split some of them up. Then we'll go straight through these houses here. And then we'll come back, then we'll deal with them when they're uh, split up a little bit. Let's look at this house. There's a zombie here. There's a zombie at the window over there. So I just came out the window here. Oh, we did get him in time. So we're not going to that house right now. We're gonna have to go check that house later. I think eventually we're gonna stop looking for food, right? I think we have enough food, and then all we're doing is going around collecting more food, and then uh, moving the zombies here. Maybe we need to actually go start collecting uh, food utensils, like uh, girdle pads and frag pads and sauce pads and cooking pots. Cause imagine they are never gonna need this uh, much food that we collected here. There's the fridge right there. Oh, we have to make this uh, smaller so it's not. It doesn't get in the way. Maybe we'll start looting like uh, cameras and wristwatches and everything. Was there another one behind him? Maybe it was just him. I was hoping. So oh, somebody did a gunfire over somewhere. So I was obviously going to be going towards the gunfire over here. So I think we'll do that, right? I think we're going to stop looking for food. I think we have enough food. I think we have enough food at the moment. So we're them to this uh, field out here. 
trying to think like these fort houses down here. We didn't get anything to these fort houses yet. Oh, we need to have a smoke. Yeah, we're not going to be able to get in this house either. There's like too many zombies in the areas now. There's three zombies up there. Oh, enough I want to go in to get the food because we're going to get trapped. Oh my god, we made it out. Oh, it was so scary. So we did make it out there with the food, right? Let's uh, go to the map and then just mark an X here. So we actually managed to get food from one of the places. So let's go down here and see if uh, this place is cleaned out a little bit. We know that there's a whole bunch of zombies down here, so we couldn't get any food from down here. But uh, maybe now we can. I think we'll bring the vehicle down here. We'll bring the vehicle down here and check it out. And maybe let's go to the trailer park. And then I think this will be our last day searching for food. I think this is going to be our last day searching for food. There's no zombies here. Unless all the zombies left. Oh, that's our chance. There's no zombies here anymore. There's more of them than I thought. Oh, they were following him. But I think we just led them to this house recently. I wonder if you get another fireman out from out of here. Oh no, this thing doesn't even kill him that quick. I think we're gonna forget about the fireman outfit. Leaving them to the houses isn't actually working. Uh, so it's going down to the trailer park, right? The uh, trailer park was the last place we are going to try. Unless there's no zombies in those places anymore. But then actually if you go there, those zombies from there are going to go down there. So the trailer park could be the last place that we're going to check. And then uh, we're going to be going looking for uh, cooking supplies. So we're just going to be looking for uh, cooking supplies next video probably. Here's the trailer park right here. Oh, they broke the doors of that place. There's so many zombies out here, we don't even feel like fighting all of them. We're luring them all away from the thing just to get some food for this place.
Oh, we need to get some ice cream. All the doors are locked in this place. Single place is locked. And we don't want to have to go. We don't want to have to go through the window. All right, so I guess we're gonna go. All the doors are locked, and we don't feel like going through the windows. How much food do we have? I guess we have a decent amount of food. We'll go drop this food off, and then we'll go searching for uh, cooking supplies, so it's not going to be such a time limited where we have food, we have to go collect it, and then try to bring it to a freezer, bring it to the uh, base as soon as we get it. We can uh, actually bring a bunch of food with us, and then go collect a bunch of uh, cooking supplies. There's nobody here. Maybe there's a whole bunch of zombies that want house over there. I think they already came here and probably like, checked all the doors and all the doors are probably locked, so we're probably just waiting for the time here. There's like zombies inside all the places anyways. So I think we're ready to move on to the next phase of the game. We keep saying that we're ready to move on to the next phase of the game, this video. Like, we're uh, done looking for food, trying to search for food, because you know the food's going to expire. But I think we have more than enough. And all we're doing is just running around, running away from zombies all day. Like, we're over here, like, uh, these places are probably opened out. We can probably go get some food from these places. I guess we already got food from these places, so uh, right behind the food store. Oh, here's the storage center. We just have to go here. And then take a left up here. Oh, we have to throw everything in here. Ah, oh, so we should just go check to see if any uh, zombies follow us. But I think there's like a camera that we threw in the fridge here too. Let's go out here. There's a zombie out here right now. Oh, we didn't get him in time. 
We're gonna level up our axe skill now, right? So if we fight some random zombies, maybe we can uh, take him out. And then uh, eventually our axes will be as good as the crowbar, hopefully. Oh, so I think we're gonna go in. We're just gonna check. We didn't have anything in here. We already checked that. I always have some ice cream here. Just trying to keep an eye on these guys. They're not coming here. Alright, <clears throat> so I think we're actually done searching for food, right? We've been uh, searching for so much food, and uh, every place we've uh, tried lately to search for food, all the doors are locked, and there's alarm systems everywhere. There's too many zombies, we don't feel like luring them and fighting them and uh, luring their houses. And uh, luring them to the house isn't working anymore, the zombies are getting smarter now. She was throwing us in the uh, freezer, so it starts freezing. We have to figure out what to do here. So we have all the water that we can need. We have all the food that we need. We just don't have the uh, equipment, like the uh, frying pans, the girl pans, the cooking pots and everything. We never went to go pick those up. And we don't like the shelf here because it's always in the way. But I guess uh, maybe it's not too bad. I uh, just have to figure out what to do here now at this point. We're not searching for food, I think. If we check the map, we got, like, uh, most of the food, right? We probably got, like, uh, more food than we needed. We probably searched uh, all the places on the map, almost. Over here, we could uh, get to these places. The doors are always locked, and the uh, zombies are always everywhere. Same with over here and everything. Over here, we tried to get in there, there but the uh, doors were locked, and we didn't feel like climbing through the windows again this time. So I think we've uh, went through the map and got as much uh, fresh food as we can actually get from everywhere. Uh, so now we're going to be searching for uh, fr frying pads, girl pads, and everything. All the uh, cooking equipment. Alright, so I think we're going to uh, end the video just because we're just like uh, changing the theme of everything. All we've been doing is just uh, going around the whole map and then uh, looting all the food. And I think that uh, we're pretty much done with doing that. So we're going to do the uh, next video. We're going to go to uh, sleep here. Just so we have like a full day in the morning. And uh, then we'll go start collecting like uh, food equipment. Now we can actually go around the map. And then we would say start going and collecting uh, all the other things around the map. Uh, now that we collected the food, right? Uh, the food, we don't have to worry about it anymore. All the other stuff, it's always going to be around the map, and we can go get it whenever we want, which I think we're going to be doing that now. But uh, all the food, I think we got so much uh, food saved up, so we don't have to worry about food for a long time. We know that. <laughs>